What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you my challenge of the Elders looting results across all three of my characters for the past week. Now before we go any further, let me know down below in that comment section if you guys received anything you wanted or needed. Also just let me know what you got. Uh, but let's just get straight into the video and starting on my Hunter. And from the 30k package I received the Lethal Nobacy. Now I think that's how you pronounce that that first word, I ain't got a clue. This is the Queen's Scout Rifle. And from the 90k package, I received the Warden Sight, which is epic. Now, the Lethal Nobacy dropping at F335. This is the Queen's Scout, obviously. Mods were crowd control and hidden hand. So, quite a nice roll. So, this thing will be kept and used for damn sure. The Warden Sight is the Helmet. This dropping is absolutely epic as my current Helmet is only a 332 defense on my Hunter, which is crazy, I know. This one dropping at a 335, so I'm super happy with it, I really am. Moving on to my Titan and from the 30k package, I received the Final Duty Pulse Rifle, dropping at a 335 attack. Mods were life support and spray and play, so roll could have been a lot better. So I think this one will just end up being infused. From the 90k package, I received the Witness Gauntlets. These dropping at 335 defense, offering discipline and strength. Mods were increased grenade throw distance and increased reload speed with scout rifles. Now moving on to my Warlock, and from the 30k package, I received the Final Duty Pulse Rifle again. And from the 90k package, I received the Keeper's Gloves. The Pulse Rifle dropping at a 334 attack and offering partial refund and feeding frenzy. This again is not the worst roll but could have been a lot better. The Gauntlets dropped at a 335 defense offering intellect and discipline. Mods were increased grenade throw distance and increased reload speed with shotguns. And that is it people, that is the loot I received across all three of my characters from this week's Challenge of the Elders. Not a bad week at all, finally got a 335 helmet on my Hunter who is now only one item of that 335 a light level and that's the artifact which I can get from numerous places so my hunter should now be my first 335 character saying that though both my warlock and titan are one item off a 335 so this next week now I should be a 335 and all three characters and what I do from then on I have no idea we just have to wait and see but guys hope you enjoyed the video do drop a like I do appreciate that support I really do thanks for stopping by as always and I'll catch you guys on that next one peace out until next time Peace. Always in the wrong.